making sure phones are on silent. All right, this is cam member spotlight, take one. I don't know why I'm so anxious. Perfect timing anyway. <laughs> My name is Cam Jarvis. I joined the chorus for the Christmas show of 2017, and I sing in the upper baritone section. When I'm not singing, I keep myself busy by playing the bass, which is a new instrument for me. I took it up during the pandemic. Um, previously, I played the saxophone, but I think bass is a much better fit for me. And I also really enjoy collecting Pokemon cards, which I've done since middle school. I literally have several thousand of them, and I love them very much. Something unique about me that people may not know is that I was homeschooled all the way through um, high school. So my mom was the main teacher. She was actually my first music teacher. Um, she taught me to play a recorder when I was about 10. I have lots of good memories, and I really enjoyed my time being homeschooled. That is a very difficult question, but I think I would have to say Feel So Good by Chuck Mangione. I've been listening to that song since I was a little kid. I was introduced to it by my dad. And my brothers and I, we used to have an unfinished basement and we would rollerblade around listening to music, including that song, and choreograph little routines to it. So yeah, it's a, it's a great song and it has a lot of great memories for me. I really enjoyed the Disney Pride and Concert show for several reasons. I've loved all the concerts I've done with SMPC, but this was the first time that the entire program was celebrating the queerness of my closest friends and I. And another reason that I enjoyed it so much is that my mother, father, and oldest brother flew out from Minnesota to come see it. I really pressured them to, and I'm so glad that they were able to make it and hear me sing such a great show. My favorite song was Under the Sea from The Little Mermaid. My favorite part was that we performed with two fans each, these shiny blue fans, and I did so much rehearsing at home, learning how to flick them open and closed and do all the movements. And it was just, it was so fun to be so silly in front of a crowd and they loved it. And it was just a great experience. This season, what I'm most excited about is learning the songs that we'll be performing at the Gala Festival in summer of 2024. Actually, I've been excited about this since 2020 because I've never been to a gala before and I'm from Minnesota, which is where it'll be held. So I'm really excited to get to perform for family and friends. Yeah.